Welcome guys to another video. Um, yesterday I posted a video about the alley and how it could be used in redstone and minecraft. I did a pretty terrible representation of what redstone it could be in and I thought I'm gonna make a much better you know representation of it and see how it would actually work in kind of like a farm area. So behind me as you can see there is a couple redstone clocks and a couple of pistons and observers everywhere. Um, I also spread this thing a lot apart, so it could be consolidated into possibly like a stack just up and down, probably 10 blocks, I would say. But yeah, this could be consolidated into a very small area. And so basically, what it does is basically what I explained yesterday, where you have a redstone clock going around for as long as it takes the wheat to grow. This isn't as long as it takes to grow, it usually takes about... Um, one minecraft day cycle if it's water to six uh six days if it's like not watered or anywhere in between if it's watered or not watered so what you would have is you would have just a kind of like track like this just continuously going around for the amount of time that you would need for that it would have to be a pretty long track or you would have to be doing something smart like i did not do here but so what would happen is it would continuously just go around and eventually it would end up being spotted by this observer. Now this observer would be connected, I haven't connected it yet, to another redstone um, network and then it would be connected to this, where I've placed this observer which observes this and then sends out another redstone signal. The first of the paths would go here and it would go through these two repeaters, come here, turn off the, come there, send a redstone signal to this red wall turn off the torch, which in turn would shut off the piston, which would be observed by this observer, which would set out another redstone signal, which would go around here, which would come over here, which would turn off this redstone torch, which would then turn off this redstone piston, which would be observed by this. And then we have a little redstone conjunction. One of them leads all the way over to here, where this dispenser would dispense water. And another one over here, where this one dispenses water as well. And so, and another one coming over here and waiting in this redstone clock. And then it would come up here and it would play um, a sound in these, note, in these note blocks. So, because it would be attracted to note blocks and it would deposit its um, items here. So you would have hoppers like right there, 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 and there. I actually should probably cover this up. The Spot open so I can get down there. But um, so in the farm, I have just some wheat seeds, and I also have a um, villager Aww. farmer to re replant all the all the seeds. Although it has destroyed some of the Aww. cropland, as you can see here. I'm just gonna fix that. I guess maybe every once in a while you need maintenance. And also for some reason I did not get this right at all, and it just flows in this one direction from both sides. So, I mean, that'll have to be fixed as well, but, oh, come on. Um, but, yeah, so, with that said, so, the water will come out, it will break these, the alleys will fly down, pick up the seeds and the wheat, and everything else that you want to be picked up from this, and then it will fly back and pause it over here. And now I forgot to tell you about the second track. Now the second track over here leads to this. Where it's another just slow moving redstone pulse that will eventually come over here, turn off this redstone torch, and allow this observer to see another redstone pulse coming through here to turn the water off. Now I can actually show this in demonstration now. And luckily it's coming right over. I'm just going to wait another cycle. And now it's all connected. So this should work. I have tested this. It seems like it's a good idea, although it's pretty expensive. You could probably definitely consolidate this very easily, like you could subtract some of those. Okay, here it goes. So, observer sees, it sent the signal out, it sent it again, and now there's two signals traveling through here. It's going to turn off the redstone torch, which is going to activate it, then it's going to deactivate it, and then there's going to be this signal here, and then it's going to play the note blocks. That was very fast. So, um... I'm probably going to slow it down in the editing. Oh, so yeah, that's basically it. It's actually pretty simple, and it's, I think, a good way to use the alley because before yesterday, I had a really terrible representation of it. But I think this 
sums it up a whole lot better of how you could use it. Um, you also could put observers like linear linearly, but then that would stop the growing process of some that might have already been almost done growing. So that isn't really a viable option, to be honest. But yeah, so that's basically it. If you want to see more redstone, more Minecraft, more LA stuff, I don't know, um, hit that like, comment, sub, or do whatever. And um, I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm hoping to make some more of these, I guess. Um, goodbye.